What's up everybody? It's a couple days before Christmas and I just smoked a good eight point right here. Whew, man. I haven't hunted much. I've been putting corn out, been putting corn out and hadn't had a chance to hunt. I got here a little late this afternoon so I, I, uh, I and I kind of figured I was gonna be late whenever I got a chance to hunt so I put my corn in the road and uh I got a pine tree that I can sneak up behind about 125 yards from from where the corn is. I had seven does come out of their feeding and all of a sudden they kept looking and looking to the buck bedroom and they kind of got antsy and jogged around a little bit and I seen a like a spike or a three point come out and then I seen the eight point come out that I've been after and uh, pretty sure I put a good hit on him and I'm gonna give him a few minutes. I'm gonna go back to the truck, get the flashlight and a good little will and I heard heard a lot of crash in about a hundred yards. He uh, run probably a hundred yards. So uh, y'all stick with me. We are going to see. We can go get him. And uh, y'all are watching Harvest Kings. All right, y'all. I gave him a little while. And I regrouped, went and got the flashlight and everything. And right here on the corn in the road where I shot him at, there's all kind of blood right here. So y'all stick with us. A 25 alt six. Put a hurting on him. More blood right there. Them Hornady bullets, man. They sure put a hurting on him. There he is. Old Florida swamp buck right here. Man. That's what I'm talking about. Thank you, Jesus. Pop them lungs right there. Alright, y'all. Man, it's been a long time coming. I hunted a stand October 5th and uh, killed a nice eight point with my bow. This is, I've hunted it once or twice since and I've been after this buck. Never could catch up with him, had him in the daylight a lot. He was in the mornings or the afternoons, usually whenever I wasn't here. I, I've only hunted it probably three times though, so just got lucky, man, just got lucky. I'm gonna drag him out to the, to the hill and, and get a little bit better videos with him right here. Thank y'all for watching Harvest Kings. I'm driving forward focus tonight and uh it's gonna be tricky tricky getting to him a good thing this thing's like a go-kart or a golf cart and i can get him a little closer <laughs> than having to drag that joker 200 yards I know what y'all are thinking. If you could see me just a minute ago, I did not jump on that log knowing it was gonna break. I thought it was a little more sturdy than that. 
But good thing I still got my cat-like moves. I sure am proud of this old buck right here. I've had a lot of pictures of him, a lot of daylight pictures. And uh, like I've said 54 times, I haven't got to hunt a whole lot. But uh, had a little opportunity this afternoon. Got in the woods about five o'clock. Had 45 minutes to hunt and uh, just thank the Lord, this joker walked out right at last shooting light. Another buck in front of him and he made those does pretty nervous. And I kind of figured he was coming. He came right out of the buck bedroom. But uh, anyways, this deer is big. He's way bigger than that eight point I killed back in October. And uh, they've been rutting pretty hard. I figured he'd been, you know, lost a lot of weight, but he hadn't. He's, he's big. He's 130 pounds probably, which is pretty good sized buck for this part of Florida. Uh, he doesn't have the biggest set of horns. He's, I would say he's at least a three year old, but hey, I am tickled and that's all that matters. It ain't gotta be a 180 inch buck to make me happy, that's for sure. Put a good shot on him, he's slightly quartered to me a little bit. And uh, it's the exit wound right there. It's 25 all six and it's Hornaday ammunition. Browning A-bolt, put a hurting on him. So uh, I'm gonna get him loaded up in the focus and I'll uh, get some shots of him hanging up, but thank y'all for watching, and I am tickled. It's December 20th, right before Christmas. This is my little Christmas present right here. So, all right, y'all. Keep it real. Earn Dog is out. All right, everybody. I want y'all to take a good look at my face, because this might be the last time y'all ever see me on Harvest Kings or any other social network or anything ever again. Cause I, let me show you why. Why? I'll probably be dead. Ford Focus is now the Buckmobile. Oh <laughs> man. We squatting. We squatting. Oh boy. I can smell some detailing coming soon. Alright y'all, well, it's good knowing y'all. Have a good night.